PWM logic. We have a multimeter reading voltage of the PWM pin and a lead that will activate relative to the PWM level. We've got our maximum spindle set to 1000 up here, 1000, and I've got 1000 set here. So that says when I do an M3 command, I should get more or less the five volts, four and a half volts, which is which is correct. So that's full level, and the lead's on full level. So let's just stop that, and then we'll go to 500 output level down here on the spindle, and do an M3. That says I should get about half voltage, and I do, and half lead level. <coughs> so. What we get from this is, switching a relay, it will have a trigger point of how high the PWM level needs to be to switch on and off. So if you've got a level too low, it's not going to switch on. Likewise, as I said, if you set your maximum spindle to zero, M3 then command then just becomes a relay switch on and off and you don't need to worry about level.